Mr. West, this next one is for you. Now you've indicated the city has been less than transparent with its drainage improvement plans, often offering vague responses <coughs> like things are getting better and we're working on it. What would you do to get citizens a more accurate representation of the drainage challenges facing the city? Well, I come from the business world, so accountability, respect, trust really means something. And sometimes we, it, when it comes to government, we roll our eyes when we talk about that. But if we're going to have true accountability, we need to show the information to everybody. And just because you spend tens of millions of dollars in government, you, you don't always get results from that. It is about efficiencies. It is about accountability. It's about showing what is to be done and what timeline it is to be done and how efficient we're doing that. Because if you don't keep track of all of that as I found in business you can have problems and that is exactly where many problems come from that's why some businesses go out of business so cities need to be efficient and they also need to follow uh, their plans and timeline and report that to the public so that the council is aware and that the citizens are aware okay mr. Eller your thoughts on uh, some of the drainage issues facing the city I've, I've been out on calls before and I've had to get TC uh, EQ actually out on those calls because uh, individuals aren't doing their job. Individuals aren't following the procedures. We already have procedures in the books for Beaumont. Uh, however, they're not following step by step and then they leave the steps out or they don't full, you know, follow through all the way. We need to address supervisors. We need to address a uh, city manager as well. Now we have a new city manager, but we need to make sure that all these individuals are held accountable for doing their job fully and make sure that all the people have the proper training. That's the only way to get infrastructure back up. All right, thank you so much. Now, Mayor Mouton, your thoughts on drainage challenges facing the city? We have approved one of the largest drainage uh, budgets in the history of this city, which is over $100 million in drainage. We have approved $60 million in sewer, $24 million in, in streets, and $22 million in water. Saying all of that, we do have timelines. The timelines have started with the ditching program and some of the other streets and drainage pro projects. And so to say that we don't have a timeline, it's not true. Okay, and I would return to Mr. West. Uh, would you like to respond to any of that? I would love to. And we, when we talk about these millions of dollars being spent, again, as a resident of Beaumont, are you experiencing this? Are you getting more information? Are you getting more transparency? <coughs> Do you know when these projects are being done and when they can expect to be finished? Is that available on our website with the city? Transparency, respect, trust, they're real words. We need to show up as a city and be responsible and be more open and also improve our efficiency in all areas. Thank you. Thank you.